Today we're going to install part number 36407 from DrawTight and we're going to install this class 2 trailer hitch receiver on a 2004 Chevrolet Impala. First we'll go ahead and show you where the hitch mounts up onto the frame of the vehicle. The hitch is going to mount up to the bottom frame of the vehicle here and here and then also it's going to mount to the outside hole here from a cross number, one on both sides and on the passenger side frame it's going to be the same existing holes but right now they're covered up by the exhaust. So that means our next step is going to be to lower the exhaust. Spray them down with a little bit of lubricant to help work them off the pins. And that gives us a little more working room to install our hardware. We'll go ahead and start installing the hardware into our frame. What's going to happen is that this block's going to go on the inside along with this bolt. And also there's two different bolt sizes in the kit. There's a short one here and there's four of those. So we're going to use in these two points the same thing on the passenger side. The long bolts will go onto the cross member towards the rear of the vehicle. We'll put a wire pull in the hole that we're going to pull our, where we want to put the hardware into, out the access hole, and then just push the block onto the wire, the inside of the frame, and then one of our short bolts, push the assembly inside, pull it back out. We'll do the rest of the holes identically the same way. All the blocks are going to be the same. At this point, we can go ahead and start installing a hitch on the vehicle. We'll put the passenger side bracket over the exhaust, let the exhaust hold up for a little bit while we get the driver's side bolt holes lined up. Now we got all the hardware started, we can go ahead and snug them down. Get the bolts snugged down, now we can give them their final torque as specified in the instructions. All that remains now is go ahead and reinstall our rubber hangers onto our exhaust and that finishes our install part number 36407 from DrawTight.